Alright folks, I'm going to attempt the Colosseum. Uh, this is not like a full attempt, I, it's, it's day one. I've only sniffed the inside of it, I really have no idea what I'm doing here. But, I want to give it an actual go, so this is what I'm wearing, because I ain't got a fucking clue. Let's see if we can get a oh, wave done. What's people wearing mage? Maybe that's the play. I remember there being mages that attacked me right away. I'm just gonna... do I have to choose a modifier? Oh, okay, I do. I'm gonna go with this one again. Maybe we can use the pillars. Didn't think about that last time, I just... Okay, so I kill this guy. Save swine the other one. Prit belly, kill this guy. Okay, kill this guy. Okay. Last one. Oh, something else has spawned. Jaguar warrior. Uh, don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Okay, that's better. Yeah, you want to make use of these pillars as much as possible. Alright. Hopefully it doesn't hit through prayer. It's like a dragon claws, that. Is it just three hit spots though, not four? Details. Ah, okay, so... We could claim 100 Sunfire Splinters and be done. I have no idea what that is. Don't know if we have. We've got some glory. Enemies explode on death. Javelin's lever. Bloody hell. Let's do another one. Might not be the best idea. Okay, we got Javelin Colossus. We got these orbs that are gonna go... Oh gosh. What is slapping me so hard? Like, through prayer. Oh fuck, there's one of them guys. Do not like them guys. It's over. Okay, so we don't get anything. I don't think we get the glory either. Not really sure what the strategy is here. Okay, I just want to see if I can unlock the bank chest. I don't know how you do anything here. It's so weird. Maybe if I just do one wave, then I couldn't unlock the bank chest. I don't know. Maybe this guy will tell me. What is glory? Gloria. Check the board over there. Ah, Colosseum scoreboard. Okay, view stats. Oh. View glory. There's no glory, 654. Bank access at the Colosseum, Fortis respawn point, improved price of stolen gloves. I don't know if I have these yet though. Oh, there's a herb patch in Fortis, that's cool. Yeah, I don't have the salute thing, so I don't think I have them yet. Yeah, I don't have enough glory. Alright, let's just do a wave. We could do the first wave at least. Okay, it's the same modifiers. Gonna start on Okay, these enemies die quick, but they hit hard. Don't wanna let that other prick sneak up on me, he's dangerous. There he is. Okay, a pretty clean wave. Oh, I'm considering trying another one. I think I just want to claim it to see if I get the bank access. Because that's the main thing. I just want to get the bank so I don't have to keep walking outside. No. That's annoying. It doesn't actually tell me how. Maybe they'll light up when you get them. But I don't know. Right, well, we'll see if we can get past two and maybe three. I don't know. Just push a bit. See how deep we get in this thing. Does the warband like just always stay together? Because it feels that way. I swear this guy's got a fucking VLS or something. I wonder if I kill him quick enough. Oh, I was going to say I wonder if I kill him quick enough if that guy doesn't spawn, but... There he is. Guess they probably spawn every time. 
The most annoying thing is the trio that you can't seem to split because the melee just gets on you. Should we go with the healing tomes one? Give that a try. Can I? I can heal up between waves, that's cool. Oh no. This can't be good. Okay, I got one. Okay. Jeez, all my food's almost gone. Oh no, not one of them cunts. Okay. Okay, we got a shaman and I think that guy's the ranger. Don't know why my defense pot wasn't up. Right, that guy's got like a 3x3 three three square, so I reckon we can get the mage loose. No, I'll just set him loose. Maybe the mage won't be able to get us. No, he's getting us. What's the play here? Hey, that was a special attack. Okay, we got the mage loose. Two waves though for an entire invent of food? It's not looking great, is it? This guy's fun. Just gotta dodge it when he throws it up. Simple enough. Pro range for the rest of it. That's wave two. Your attack range is reduced by two tap. I'm using melee. How does that work? Do I have a minus two? <laughs> Extra random warp on the spawns. Energy orbs. I mean, I'm not, I don't have food, so I'm just going to claim this and see if we can get the bank chest yet. I don't know. We'll have a bit more glory at least. Ah. Yo, you beat your previous glory high score. Right, so it's a high score system. Okay. Do we have anything yet? Don't think so. I think we were still being called rookie before. All right, I'm going to see how range feels. All right, first ranged attempt. I'll take the prayer dry one, I haven't done that one yet. Gonna need prayer Maliar. This guy just hits like a truck. I think you have to, yeah. That seemed to work out better than the previous attempts. Prayer melee and focus the others. Usually I feel like mages are the worst, so I'm always praying mage, but that was not the play there because we'd just done wave one with like zero damage. Maybe range is better too, I don't know. Can we just totally safe the spot this guy with ranged? Not that way. That way? Yeah, north, south, you can safe spot these guys, that's interesting. Wave one down, no food spent. Enemies explode on death. Well, we're playing range, so that's not that bad. Holy shit, that was not good. That was not good. This is so sketchy. Oh, I forgot the explosion. Oh shit, that was close. Oh no, that's not good. I'm dead. <laughs> Some things to adjust to. Okay, I don't think we need the stam. Maybe I need to be in a different position for the second wave. I start in a different place, maybe they'll come at me differently. Accidentally double sit the range pot, good way to start. Okay, wave one we've got down now. It's wave two that I don't have at all figured out. I take a lot of damage on wave two. I'm trying to move into a different pillar. I'm pretty sure this is a different pillar. I don't think it'll make any difference whatsoever, but who knows, maybe. Always make sure you're praying before getting him safe spot. That's just a note to self. Okay. I do not like the sound of it that because of the tri-bridge shit that happens. <sighs> that puts a time limit on the wave. I mean, I'm not planning on taking damage. Okay, that actually did work out better. I don't know if I just got 
kind of lucky, or if they actually did spawn and move in a different way, but I'm going to colour each of the pillars differently, so that in my head I can associate them with... Oh shit. Good job I saw that dude coming in. He's safe spot anyway though. Yeah, if I have like a different colour on each of them, then I know... Like the green one is wave 2, the... Oh, there's a mage there as well. Red one is wave... Where we went on wave 1, but we don't necessarily have to go there on wave 1. Okay. Last enemy. So we kinda got wave 2 a bit more solved now. I'd, I'd say this is more like the Inferno than the Fight Caves, because I'm having to use these pillars a lot more. And think about like positioning and stuff, but yeah. I barely have any Inferno experience. I've never completed one, so. I've just done a few waves in leaks. 60% of damage received. Javelins leave a temporary pool of molten sand where they land. I'm guessing that just means the ones that he throws over the head. I think I'm fine with that. Yeah, see if we can get wave three done. Okay, two rangers, this cunt, and I feel like we want to not be in this position right now. Okay, there we go. Okay, get that one. What the fuck? Oh, that was the molten thing. It threw it over. I see. Well, it was going well. Till the last bit. Okay, so it doesn't tell you how much glory you need for each rank, but the first rank does give you the bank chest. I feel like I've got to try and do wave three. I figured the first two out, so... At least I think. Okay, I'm gonna eat an anglerfish before going in as well. Every little helps. I've already forgotten which corners were which. Yeah, just keep on with that one. Okay, he's already saved. Just realised I didn't even pod up, but we'll pass the danger point now, so I may as well wait. Okay, so I actually wanna go... Oh, he won't let me move. Okay, I see. Okay, I think we can deal with that. We just need to... Like actually be aware of it like we are. Yeah, it does they do spawn in different places, so it does matter where you stand. Very interesting. Oh no. Keep forgetting about that. Okay, so far so good. I was hoping we'd be far enough away from the mage there, but we weren't. Okay, I'm just gonna kill this guy with pretty melee up. Oh no. And because I think the pillars do matter, I think I'm going to try and get to a different one. I'm going to try and go to the red one over there. See if we can separate them as well. That did not separate them. Yes. Pretty sure we already had the reinforcements this wave as well, so I shouldn't have to worry about that. This is just wave two though. It's wave three that we got bombed on last time. Partially due to the modifier that I chose, and me not remembering that I'd chosen it. But we'll see. Okay, so we can get that same option on again, or we can increase... I think I'm just going to increase Blasphemy. The loot's good right now, but my glory isn't looking better, so I want, I want glory over loot. I'm not here for loot, am I? Oh no, there's another one on me. Okay, I managed to uh, separate. Okay, we're getting somewhere. <gasps> oh my gosh. All right, gotta be careful of the aerials. Nothing too major. Killing one of these is the same as killing two. Just slightly more to pay attention to. They're pretty consistent with the timing of that javelin throw as well, actually. It seems like it's the same amount of basic attacks before they do an overhead throw. Every single time. 
I have no idea where I want to be stood for a potential wave 4. I don't even know if we do wave 4 if we take the 3 and see if that's enough for the chest. Really, I just want the chest. Obviously, I want all the loot from here, but having the bank chest is just such a quality of life improvement for making continued runs that I'd say it's worth leaving for over risking not getting it. I mean, the glory's gone up. I think we just... We claim it. Every wave we do, we're just going to have to claim it until we get that fucking next rank. There's not that many waves. There's only like 13 or 14, so... Hey, we reached the brawler status. That's sick, that's sick. We should be able to use this. Yes, we finally got the bank chest. Okay, three waves, folks. That's what you have to do to get the bank chest. All right. Okay, so I think those are in order that you unlock them as you rank up, so that is interesting. The rewards seem a little different each time. I think I'm gonna have one more crack and just see how far we can get before things look dire. Okay, round whatever attempt this is, we'll go for that one. I'm just gonna head straight to green, see how that works out. Pretty sure it's green we want to be on for wave two, so. All right, relatively clean first wave. A swarm of angry bees. Yeesh. Let's give it a go. Haven't seen it yet, gotta try it. Oh no, there's the swarm. Can I, like, scare it off by attacking it? I don't like the look of it. Oh, literally just one hit it. That's fine. Is bees just, like, a free one? I guess sometimes they do stuff like that, don't they? Like, here, this is the one that you pick if you don't actually want to try. I'm gonna see if I can set one of these guys free. I'm guessing as long as you kill the bees before they get to you, fine. I think I'm gonna go for this pillar down here for the next one. Yellow. Don't know if I've tried that. I feel like I did start at green one time and it didn't work great. Okay, bees two, two swarms, javelins. I don't think reducing my attack range is that bad, because buff is really long anyway, so... That's fine. Okay, I need to split these two up, though. That's the problem. Oh, shit. One slummy. Oh, no. Alright, I'm gonna make one more attempt and then call it for now as, like, first hour attempts of Colosseum. Maybe there's a better strategy to deal with the warbands, but I can't think of it. It's tough because they all hit pretty hard. So like, how how do you prioritize your prayers when they all slap you? Is wave one always the same options? I feel like it is. Right, it's our wave three that needs some work. I haven't figured out the best place to stand to lure things at the start of the round, so I'm gonna try blue this time. Okay. Yeah, we'll go with Blasphemy. All right, all right. Oh, this actually looks like a good spawn. Or is this round two? Am I tripping? Is this round two? This is wave two. We already knew we could do wave two over there. I'm done. But blue also looks safe for it, so I guess that is still knowledge gained. I have to deal with this guy first. Jeez. Jeez, it's so hard to get just one of them out. Still didn't even get one of them out. Ridiculous. Please. Oh my gosh. Come on. Awful. Fuck me, man. I used most of my food on that. I haven't figured out how to separate them properly yet. Don't even know if we'll make it to wave three this time. Alright, that's two down. 
Still don't feel like I've figured out this wave yet. I guess we're going Blasphemy 3. Okay. Here it goes. Okay, just kill this. Just kill this. Just die. Just die. Come on, just die. Jesus. That took some doing. Okay, this one next. That one's saved. I've got them two to separate still. Which is where I take most of my damage, so fuck knows how I'm gonna manage that. Uh. Oh, and there's one back there. Uh, okay, I have no idea how I managed to just get that one, but maybe it's because he was in the front. I feel like blood magic's probably essential here, just to conserve resources through the waves. Same so as anything like fire cape or whatever when you go for it. Alright, that's three down. To be honest, the loot is looking alright. There's no chance that I can do the next wave. I did kind of want to see what wave 4 looks like, but with 4 rune kite shields, I'm kind of tempted to just take it. It's not bad, is it? For an extra 150 death runes, and we might not get anything. We'll just take it. Not seen any unique rewards yet, though. I don't know where they come in, if they're just later down the line, or if you get them somewhere else. Like, now that I have glory. It says untradeable rewards may be unlocked by reaching certain thresholds, but I don't know where you get them. Like, you just go talk to people, oh shit. It says citizens may reward you. Like, what does that even mean? Is there anything down here? Nice little Hunger Gamers reference. Is this just like training areas? Why is no one allowed to pass? Uh, I'm afraid you're gonna have to tell me. Can I get into the other way? Oh, who's this fella? Just some loser. Is this not where they told me it was a restricted area? Oh no, it's not. That's there. See, neither of these even have, like, the doors don't even have options. What a weird area. Oh, is that where, like, all the money is or something? Is that what they're saying? I get it. Fucking all. Right, well, we've not learned a great deal, except that we can do about three waves before running out of supplies as things stand. I don't know the optimal setup or gear or anything like that. A lot of people seem to be stood around in mage gear, so... Maybe that is the way to go with blood, like I said. It would definitely help with the sustain inside. I'm just not on the ancient spellbook right now. And uh, yeah, there are far more talented people than me that can figure out the optimal way to do uh, the Colosseum. But that is the first hour or so of my experience with it. If you've enjoyed the video, please do leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you see all my future content. Got plenty more Valamor stuff along the way as well as one hour limit lock to my series where I go for various goals despite only being able to play for one hour each day. Feel free to go check that out. It's a lot of fun over there and we're still running it even through all the Valamore release. I'm still going to be putting a video out every day in that series so plenty of content around on the channel. Leave a comment down below let me know how you're enjoying Valamore so far and if you've attempted the Colosseum how deep you get. Are you deeper than me? It's probably likely that you might be because uh, I'm, I'm not very far. I, I don't go too deep. There's another X joke in there somewhere. But until next time, look after yourselves. Be lovely to one another. And I'll see you on the next one.